presentation is about childhood disorders um, as part of the uh, neuroscience topics. Uh, the topics which we'll cover include autism, attention deficit hyperactivity disorder, Down syndrome, and dyslexia. We'll start by the autism. Uh, the main features of autism include impaired social skills, verbal and nonverbal communication difficulties, obsessive uh, interests, and repetitive behaviors. Uh, it is not only the autistic features, but also there might be other associated problems like intellectual disability, seizures, and gastrointestinal symptoms. Uh, what about the incidence of autism now in USA? Uh, it is recorded to be one in every 110 babies. This incidence is increasing uh, because of two things. Number one, changes in the diagnostic criteria, detection of subtle forms, enhanced referral, and due to the increased number uh, of actually detected cases, which denotes the interplay between the genetic and the environmental factors. Uh, autism is highly genetic, and this is based on the twin studies. Uh, there are more than 100 genes which have been linked with the increased risk. Currently, there is no single genetic mutation or biological change that can predict the autism. What about the diagnosis? Most of the children are di typically diagnosed based on the uh, detection of the behavioral symptoms at about three years of age. There might be some sensitive measures of social engagement and the interaction which can detect differences in children one to two years of age. Why this is happening? Because of the accelerated abnormal brain growth at this time. However, there might be some forms which are due to dysregulation of the immune system, uh, either in the child or in the mother, and these forms usually need laboratory investigations. How about the autism or uh, brain, the brain alterations of the autism? The changes are not obvious. There might be abnormal development of center lesions like language, cognition, and social communication. Uh, and there might be some abnormal connections with other brain parts. The treatment, there is no drugs for the major symptoms of the autism, only specialized behavioral therapies, which are based on the learning theory with early interventions giving better outcomes. All the treatment modalities are based on understanding of how the brain normally reacts to learning, bonding, and social challenges. We know that autism is a disabling condition, however, there might be bright and very creative people who are having very subtle forms of autism. They have what's called high-functioning autism. Uh, and they, some believe that they don't want to be cured, they like to be accepted as they are. Among these, Albert, Albert Einstein, Amadeus Mozart, Bill Gates, Charles Darwin, Temple Grandin, George Washington, Hans Christian Andersen, Ishaq Newton, Jacob Barnett, Van Gogh, and Woody Allen. This part finishes our uh, lecture on the childhood disorders, typically the autism.